Welcome back, everybody, to Pop Culture Conspiracy. I'm your host, T. How are y'all doing today? And in this video, I'm going to be talking about Nicki Minaj's sister, Ming, completely making a fool out of herself and allowing herself to be used by the industry to go against her sister. Before I hop in, please like, share, and subscribe. Let's talk in the comments, and please turn on the notifications. So you guys, I mean, if you're a Nicki fan or if you're on the internet, I'm sure you're aware of Ming going out of her way to be seen to be noticed she wants to be famous so bad and she wants some press so okay i'm gonna give her the press that she wants and i'm making this video because i just really hate to see this i really hate to see how she's again so naive and this just shows how much she should not be a part of this industry the industry is really dark really predatory and again really evil and um, it will definitely take advantage of people who, again, are desperate and are looking for a come up and for people who will just do anything for anything. Yeah, this industry is definitely going to have their way with you. I think it's really crazy that of all the things Ming listens to from Nikki, she's not listening to when Nikki tells people finish school, go to school. You know, it's like, Ming, that's what you need to be doing. You need to be trying to be in somebody's school. You need to be, like, really trying to better yourself because this is not the way to do it. Taking a million interviews, you know, about your sister is just not a good look. And people feel like Nicki Minaj is being bitter and mean and a mean girl and going against her own sister. And I just don't see it that way. I think Ming is doing a lot of really disgusting stuff that I would not want to fuck with her for either i mean you're letting these people bait you and ask you questions like oh cardi versus nikki that's your fucking sister so it should always that should not that shouldn't even be a part of the conversation and again nikki i know she may sound inebriated on station head but she's not lying when she's like it's again suspicious if somebody not in your line of work is doing interviews with people in your line of work about you like, I mean, you just can't, you can't justify that. You can't explain that. And I, I do believe the, the whispers that Ming is not all the way mentally there. Um, I've seen her on camera enough to, to again, make my own opinions and, and again, question her mental intelligence and her mental wellness. Um, but again, it's like, you're the perfect victim you're the perfect victim. You're not all the way, you know, stable and you want to come up really bad. That is a recipe for disaster. And again, it's like, haven't you seen all the stuff that your sister has gone through in the industry? You know, you of all people should know what, you know, famous people go through because again, you're related to one of the biggest artists, you know, on the planet right now. And all you want to do is again, like, like Nicki Minaj said, mooch and, you know, and ride her coattail and like try to build some type of popularity off of that. You know, it's like, why can't you just like do you and relax? Like, why can't you just like do your own thing? Like, we don't see Hennessy and Solange constantly taking interviews about their sisters. Like, we just don't. And so I think Ming is just, again, young, desperate wants to be seen wants validation and the industry chews people like that up and spits them out um again you guys i just i can't i can't be you know against nikki on this like i really just am disgusted by this i would not want my family member either trying to come up off of my success ming has no talent she can't dance she can't sing she can't rap she can't act if she could do any of those things then she would have followed in her sister's footsteps and gone to an art school and you know like yes she she wants to make a way for herself off of her relation to Nicki minaj not make a way for herself off of her own talent because she has no talent she clearly she can't do hair she can't do makeup she can't be an assistant she can't really do anything to benefit Nikki other than, you know, what, do interviews. And, sh and she claims that, oh, she just wants to like, wants her sister to be proud of her. And, you know, I just want to make it on my own. But you don't, though, because, you know, you don't. Because if, if you did, you wouldn't be trying to 
you know what I'm saying, use your sister's name for interviews. Like, they got plenty of actresses and actors who have very successful, famous parents, and they changed their name. Like, you know, like, hasn't Malia Obama done that? She changed her name, dropped her last name, because she doesn't want to try to get it off of her last name. She doesn't want to, you know, be questioned about her success. She doesn't want that Nepo baby title, you know, being branded on her as to why she's getting against certain deals and certain things. And she can never help that. She's always going to have a particular privilege and favor in the world because of who she's related to. That's She can't control that. But she's clearly trying to fight against some of that to make it on her own. So it's like, Ming, you're not doing that. And that's why this whole conversation about you just want your sister to be proud of you. You want to make it on your own. It's not genuine. And, you know, again, there are people who just don't like Nicki Minaj and who just swear that they're going to make her the villain. And so they they see it from a particular angle of, damn, you beefing with your own sister. But this woman is having attacks from all angles. She's getting attacked from peers in the industry she's getting attacked by media again the own industry that she's in and she's now having it coming from her own family so i just i don't see ming as innocent or a victim here i definitely see her as a freeloading clout chaser who's setting herself up to get extremely taken advantage of by the industry and I think if this girl really wanted to make her sister proud she would be asking Nikki to pay for her to get a really great education and she would go get that education and go like do something great with it. So that's just my opinion on Ming. I really don't see it for her. She wants to be famous. She wants press. I hope this video, you know, satisfies that craving that she has. But I also hope that it really like wakes her up and it's like, girl, if, if you want to like do anything on your own, this is not the way you need to check yourself and you look crazy on social media. So that's just my opinion. Let's talk in the comments, y'all. Bye.